51 goals on the season for Lydia Faust. As the eight meter coming and a score as Marquette ties it at one. Lydia Faust, it'll be a tall task for anybody to beat them as the Pioneers have not lost to anybody. Ellie Henry wins the draw off the wing as Mary Blee shot it to her. Fast break and a score. Marquette with a terrific goal. As a foul called and an eight meter coming up here for the Golden Eagles as the shot is a score for Lydia Faust. The fifth year kid out of Redwood City, California, the San Francisco native on the restart here goes with a beautiful shot that time to beat Conquest. Cats with their 10th turnover. Now the fast break Marquette offense. They have a two on one developing here with Byerly who scores. And Meg Byerly gives Marquette their first lead of the ball game. They play zone here if you're Marquette with a seven on six for Villanova. And it's taken away. Wonderful job defensively to read. Depends. And you have some of these young kids like Byerly and Osborne who have made Marquette even better. There's a shot and a score by Shea Garcia, their all time points leader. And Marquette regains the lead. It was a 22 win to seven win over Xavier where Garcia broke the Marquette points record previously established by Grace Gabriel. Garcia has had a fabulous career. Shea scored a Marquette record, eight goals in that win over Xavier. Parker Stadium, and hopefully the ideas get a lot of fans there, especially a lot of ACC fans. There's a beautiful finish inside again. Shea Garcia. And Mark does it. recruiting for a two-year window was exclusively online. They happened to see footage of her, and I think it's worked out well. And that's working out well going to the West Coast, finding Lydia Faust. She's become one of the best players in Marquette history. You almost have a loss for words when you're trying to stop that young lady who's returning for an extra year. Very frightening. Mary Schumar, she's been scary all year for opponents as she fills it up. And Marquette's on the score sheet here in the third quarter. The final. The Golden Eagles looking for more. They've scored higher. Byerly makes sure of that. She puts it in. 9-7 Marquette. In these draws, if you're going the opposite direction, that puts on the full clear against Marquette's ride. And they have speed and athletes, and now you cough it up. So, yes, Lydia Faust, all Big East first teamer each of the last two years. She'll be on the first team again. Beautiful quick stick action inside for the Golden Eagles. They know how to score, that's for sure. As they do it again, it's 10 to seven Marquette. The feed is always there, and there's Byerly again crashing for the score. Meg Byerly, year leading by two. 45 left on the timer. They played fast all year. They keep their foot on the gas pedal there. They score it inside. Really good stuff that time from the Golden Eagles on that quick work inside, and they do it again. It's there for Sakadato as she scores it. The part of the game, another 30 seconds or so. If Marquette scores here, the game's probably over, and it is. Osborne scores, 12 to eight. That might be the cherry on top. The Colorado